Suppose you have a piece of ideal string, that is, string with a length, but no depth to it at all. What I'm holding isn't perfect string. It's rather thick, so it's not a true one-dimensional string. But use your imagination, which everybody has. Then you can think of it as a string. If you take the string and wind and wound and twist and turn and tangle things up, then you connect the two ends together, you get a knot. A mathematical knot should not have dangling ends. The two ends should fuse together. The simplest knot you can make is called a trefoil. Just take a piece of string, tie a loop, and connect the tips. This is what it looks like when you spread it out on a table. Hmm. There are books and books and books written about knots. Mathematicians call it knot theory. Sometimes you want to know how much you can untangle a knot. How much can you simplify it? Here's another puzzle. When you are given two knots, can you tell if they're identical to each other? Maybe they should teach knot theory to sailors. <laughs>